Hello and welcome back to another lecture. Before you can install Docker on your Windows computer, you must make sure you have enabled virtualization on your computer. The virtualization is always enabled on your computer by default. And to check whether the virtualization on your computer is enabled, watch this video. The question being asked is how to enable virtualization, meaning VTX, in your BIOS in Windows 10. Well first, let's make sure that your virtualization is in fact disabled. To do this, you want to hold down the Windows key on your keyboard and press R. Now type in CMD and hit enter. Now that CMD is open, you want to type the following. Systeminfo.exe and hit enter. Now find Hyper-V requirements and to the right you'll find virtualization enabled in firmware. Over here if it says no, then now we have confirmed that the virtualization in our device is in fact disabled and we can move on. After you've watched this video to check whether virtualization is enabled on your computer. If virtualization is not enabled on your computer, I'll leave a link in this video's description for the videos you can watch to enable virtualization on your computer. The process of enabling virtualization on your computer requires restarting the computer. That is why I couldn't record it. If you also have any questions, please leave your comments in this video's description. Thank you and I'll see you in the next lecture. Bye.